If I were a rich man. Dying. The very first review from Variety, there are memorable songs in this musical. People were crying in the dressing room. I remember thinking, oh God, I'm gonna be out of work in a couple of months. Someone sent me a book by Shalom Aleichem, and we thought there's a musical in it. You want to do a musical about a bunch of old Jews in Russia going through a pogrom? I mean, what are you out of your mind? I said Jerry Robbins should do it. What Jerry did with West Side Story was a huge accomplishment. Jerry is the only genius I've ever met. I was trying to realize what Sholem Aleichem had written, but inevitably what was happening in the world had to affect the way I felt and, and the way I thought. When you are a young adult, you see yourself as one of the daughters who's trying to break out into the world. As a parent, you see the show completely differently. Huddle! Oh, Huddle! Have I made a match for you? He's handsome. He's young. All right, he's 62. Matchmaker, matchmaker, plan me no plans. I said there's one enormous problem of me directing the film. What would you say if I told you I was a goy? And there was absolute silence. Norman Jewison is a goy? <laughs> I'm Puerto Rican, my wife is Dominican and Austrian. There's maybe two Jewish members of that whole wedding party. Fiddler captures those big moments in our lives, moments of transition, moments of tradition breaking, tradition renewing. What is that that makes it speak in so many languages and everybody thinks it's about them? On a gut level, we all are connected to this. I don't think there's any other show that has done that for more people. As long as humankind continues to have struggles, Fiddler on the Roof will be there. Tradition! 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 Tradition!